YouTube, what's going on? It's Juan Gotti here with another video, and in today's video, we have some more Washington football news. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the quarterbacks, of course. So we're going to be talking about why Alex Smith coming back is just going to help Dwayne Haskins even more to secure the starting job and even have that, maybe that Patrick Mahomes effect. Not saying he'll be as good as one Patrick Mahomes, but saying that Alex Smith can teach him up and teach him everything he taught Patrick Mahomes, he can do the same for one Dwayne Haskins. So without further ado, let's get straight into today's video. But before we do, make sure you go down below, leave a like on this video, subscribe if you're new, and turn on post notifications so you get notified when I upload a video about the NFL, or in this case, our Washington football team. And let's get straight into today's video. So how Alex Smith coming back will actually help Dwayne Haskins because a lot of people feel as though, and I, and I can't I can't blame you for it, but a lot of people feel as though that they're just like beefing with each other. And of course, they're not, I'm not going to say they're not friends because they are friends, but of course they're going to have that competitive nature because they all want to be, be the one to lead the, the team to the best place possible, and that's winning a Super Bowl. So, I mean, I can understand why a lot of people feel as though that they're not, you know, I would say friends in a way, but... I, I don't think so. You know what I'm saying? I feel as though that Dwayne Haskins, this is his team. And I know a lot of people are going to beg to differ with me down below in the comment section, which is cool and all, but it's his team. But with Alex Smith coming back, it's not only going to help Dwayne Haskins like on the field, but it's just going to fill him the most. And a lot of people are saying that he's nervous. He, you know, he had a couple bad passes. So did Kyle Allen. So it happens. But a lot of people are saying he's nervous because Alex Smith is back. I don't think so. I just think that it, they didn't have no OTAs, no mini camps. So it's just, you know, all training camp. And they have to get, you know, I'm not saying shape, but just in rhythm. And it always takes time for the offense to get in rhythm. But I guarantee you, once they get in a rhythm in a week or two, they are going to be dangerous. And that's just me um, being honest. Alex Smith, his comeback story is great. Don't get me wrong. I really, I really had to talk to him because no man... Well, I didn't think no man would be able to pull that off. I mean, from having a, a life-threatening injury, almost dying, to almost having your leg amputated, to coming back and being able to pot and being able to possibly start for a football team again is just crazy, man. I mean, this guy yesterday he even uh had played in nine or nine nine on nine yesterday, and he had a pass rush and he evaded the pass rush. So that's really good for Alex Smith. But I just feel as though that he's 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 36 years old, and I don't I just don't feel comfortable with Lee having a 36 year old 37 year old quarterback leading my team especially with him coming off an of injury now if he was healthy I would still be I would ha I would be happy I would I would want Alex Smith to be the leader but he's just coming off that major injury we just don't know how he's gonna you know react so I just don't trust it so why Dwayne why Alex Smith is gonna be here for Dwayne Haskins why it's a good thing that he's actually back to help Dwayne Haskins the reason why I say that is just because he's just gonna he's gonna help Dwayne Haskins. I mean, Alex Smith is that kind of guy. He's not that guy to be stubborn and to just be mad that he's not the guy. I mean, look look for what he did with Patrick Mahomes. If he can just give us ten percent of what he did for Patrick Mahomes, we would be good. Cause I mean, I'm not saying Dwayne is gonna be as good as Patrick Mahomes, but I'm just saying if he if Alex Smith can be what he was for Patrick Mahomes just a tad bit. We would be thankful and we would really be happy. I mean, you can even see it. Pat Patrick Mahomes, and I know we all know this already, but Patrick Mahomes said it himself in, a, in an interview at the Super Bowl. He said, thank you to Alex, man, because without Alex, I really would not be here. So Alex Smith is that kind of guy. We know what kind of guy he is, and I just, I'm happy. I'm happy we have him on our team, whether he's the starter or not. I really, I really, you know, still happy that he's on the team. But other than that, it's not really a big day um, for the guys. You know, Ron Rivera got diagnosed with cancer late last night, and it was really sad. But um, it's an off day for the guys, so it's no really no training camp news to talk about. I was really going to hold this video off to Saturday, but I couldn't leave you, leave you guys hanging with no video, so I had to get to work early. Now, one thing else I can talk about here about the whole situation is that it's going to be a good battle, and it's already been a good battle, but a lot of people seem to not be talking about Kyle Allen. And I know I've been, you know, like hating on Kyle Allen this whole offseason because I don't want him to start because I want Dwayne to start, obviously. But Kyle Allen's looked good, too. I mean, he's had he had a couple interceptions, too. But, I mean, he's looked really solid, too. So whoever ends up being the starter, it's going to be happy for us. But then at the same time, it's gonna, we're going to be mad because if it's not Dwayne, it's going to be like we just wasted a, a first-round draft pick on a guy that we don't trust. But 
I feel as though it's not going to be like that. I mean, the guys already made it clear without actually saying that this is Dwayne's team. But I'm pretty sure everyone in that locker room knows it's Dwayne's team. I mean, Adrian Peterson even came out and said it in the interview saying it's his team. So we know it's Dwayne's team, but we're just waiting for that confirmation, that, that big relief of <sighs> when we can finally just... <sighs> You know what I'm saying? And, and and it says Dwayne Haskins is the starter. We know it is, but we just need that confirmation. So it, it's going to take some time. But, I mean, other than that, um, Alex Smith is really the best, best player possible to be in this predicament with one Dwayne Haskins. Now, I wonder how it would be if he was to beat Dwayne Haskins. I, I know everyone would just be coming to my channel and, and raging at me saying, I told you, I told you so, but come on, guys. Let's just be real. Alex Smith is still not 100% healthy, and it's good to see what he's been able to do, but he's not ready, and I don't think he will be ready. And I just, even if he is 100% ready, I just don't feel comfortable with him being out there, man, because it, it just takes one play. And I know you can say that for anybody else in the NFL, but specifically for one Alex Smith, it literally takes just one play. And I just can't have that happening again, not even just for my team or just for football sake, but just for a human sake and being a dad and having a family at home. I just don't want that. I don't. I never wish that on somebody. I don't wish that on my worst enemy. So it's just like, just be, just please be careful, please. I mean, like, and if you feel as though that you really want to start again and you don't win this job and you wish to go elsewhere i hope they you know just pull the trigger and let you go because i mean we love you man but like i just don't feel comfortable and if i'm the if i'm the trainer if i'm the owner i would just have to tell them that too but of course they're not going to say that but i would just be blunt and honest with them man i just don't feel comfortable with alex smith being out there but last thing is how he how he helps Dwayne Haskins that last thing is just because him being there when Dwayne is actually named to start in the mid game he could come up to him and tell him what he needs to go out there and do better the next drive and stuff like that that's just what you need on this team I mean and that's what this quarterback room is I mean you have Dwayne you have Alex Smith you have Kyle Allen Kyle Allen and Alex Smith both know the playbook like the back of their hand so when Dwayne finally catches up to speed cause I mean uh, uh, Ron Rivera did say Dwayne isn't far behind Behind from those two guys, but when he catches up to speed, he's going to be able to. They're both going to be able to, even if they're not starting. Whoever's starting, they both can just help each other on the sideline. You know what I'm saying? It's not nothing bitter about it. There's no one. Everyone loves each other. No one hates each other. It's just a good competition quarterback room, and that's what a lot of people are getting misconstrued. They think everyone just hates each other, and that's not the case. It's just one big competitive uh, group, and everyone wants to be a starter. But unfortunately, it's only going to be one player. And fortunately for us, it's going to be the way it has because that's what I'm hoping for. So, as always, it's your boy Juan Gotti. Like, comment, subscribe, host for the Washington football team. And I just wanted to come on here quickly and make a quick video on why Alex Smith is actually being back and going to help Dwayne Haskins. Once again, we'll quickly run through it. One is going to fill him to be, you know, wanting to be the starter even more for Because he's probably going to be like, oh, this is a competition. Let me, you know, go out there and prove myself. Two, Alex Smith can always help Dwayne Haskins, even if he's the starter or not. And then three, just having Alex Smith presence there, man. Just the type of person that he's that he is, is just going to help Dwayne Haskins even more. Because, I mean, Alex, Alex Smith is just a great person, man. So, as always, Big Bill Juan Gotti, like, comment, subscribe, host of the Washington football team. We are, we are officially 23 days away from giving Philly that beatdown. So, as always, Ben Boy and Gotti for the third time. Like, comment, subscribe, and to watch the football team. I'm out. Peace. I love them sticks, nigga, with them forty. She love my dick, go away, horny. Ain't getting back, do you already inform me? Can't fuck with these niggas, nigga, be corny. I'm a shit, I look stepping, there was no Jordans.